Tonight, uh, here in Leesburg, Virginia, we have the second F.W. de Klerk Memorial Lecture. The hosts are the Global Leadership Foundation, one of the foundations that F.W. de Klerk created. This is the second memorial lecture and it will be delivered by Professor Chet Crocker, who was the American Assistant Secretary of State for African Affairs during the 80s and during F.W. de Klerk's presidency. I remember visiting South Africa in 1990 and F.W. invited me to his office in Pretoria. We had a catch up. At one point, F.W. said to me, Chet, how are we doing? How am I doing? It was an amazing question to be put to a visiting American after all we had been through together. I said, are you sure you really want to ask that question? Do you? <laughs> I said to him, you're doing pretty good. <laughs> the time has passed for visiting Americans to give sermons because South Africans are shaping their own destiny. I'll never forget that meeting. You know, Chet Cocker worked closely with S.W. de Klerk, and he knew just what a leader S.W. de Klerk was. You know, in the history of mankind, there have been few occasions when wise and courageous leadership has stepped in and changed the world. F.W. de Klerk was one of those instances. He was one of those leaders. What he did in South Africa and then throughout Africa changed, in my view, was the greatest boon to human rights during my lifetime. Yeah, I grew up in a generation when there were problems taking place on the world scene that you just knew were never going to be solved in our lifetime. And certainly the situation that took place in South Africa was in that category. And then I remember watching that speech in February of 1990, one of the most dramatic speeches I've ever seen. And the world was introduced to a new leader and a new vision and a new path forward. And the rest, as they say, is history. So the link here is FW's ability to make things possible. And of course, he was that was the man he was. He had impact. He had vision. He knew what he wanted to achieve. Uh, and he set about achieving it. And of course, as everybody here knows, he had the impact in South Africa. But as far as the Global Leadership Foundation is concerned, his significance is far wider than that. It went out to millions of people all around the world and we are delighted to be part of continuing that work. Mm -hmm.